How's it going, guys? Welcome back into Kurt Magoo Sports and Slaughterhouse Sports. And today we're going to talk about another Clemson wide receiver commit. This guy out of Rockwell, Texas. Okay, it is Noble Johnson. So, Noble, just like the Nobel Peace Prize. So, Noble. Uh, Johnson and here's the thing about Noble he's 6'2 he's 200 pounds and you know he's a guy that is is very good at you know making it making a catch in contested areas all right he has really good size for the position Um, he's a he's a good route runner for a big guy all right So the thing is, you have Nathaniel Joseph, who's kind of your take-the-top-off-of-the-defense type of guy. Olsen Henry also has a lot of speed. So, you know, when it comes down to catching big third down passes, you know, this guy uses his body really well because at times he won't – and this this is a play that's tough to get separation on, but his speed – I mean, I would say that there are other parts of his game that are better than just the clear, just downfield 40 time speed. He might have, he might run like a 4 6 or 4 7, which is still, you know, incredible. You know, it's still better than, much better than the average receiver, or no, better than the average person. So here he's going to, you know, start using tricks in his, you know, in his footwork. And then he's going to make a tremendous high point catch very athletically over two bodies. So he's he is a safety blanket and he is a huge red zone threat for a quarterback because a quarterback's going to be able to throw the ball up to Noble and Noble's going to go out there and make a play on it. All right. So, I mean, here you see him break through. Here you see him separate. So, you know, the first 12 to 15 yards of the route, he has good footwork, okay? So, he obviously is very good at catching the football. Um, it's, you know, is he can beat press coverage. It's how effective is he going to be getting open because, he, you know, he's very good at catching the football, high pointing the ball. The speed might be an issue on deep balls. Like, can he separate? Is he fast enough to separate? Like, that's something that we're going to honestly see. You know, this is an honest eval. And, I mean, here he separates great. So, you know, we're, we're rooting for Noble. We're rooting for Clemson. Uh, we're rooting for all these guys that you know we we uh, we we break down film on them. It's just at the college level, how well it, can he still make explosive plays? Because is he going to be fast enough? That's the only thing. I mean, his route running uh, can be even more crisp. It can it, it can be better, but it's still pretty it's pretty effective right now. I mean, I I like his footwork. Here is just a straight deep ball. The defender kind of leaves him. Uh, but when the ball's in the air, the guy has great hands and he really is a reliable pass catcher. And we saw that he can make contested grabs. So in the red zone, he's going to be very pivotal for Clemson. I definitely think he serves a role on this team. He's a bigger wide receiver. You could put him at X and he's 6'2", has the body type of an NFL guy. And then just look at the toughness here. I mean, he, this is a head-on collision and that DB takes the brunt of that head-on collision. So he he really plays tough. Um, has a great relationship with Kate Klubnick, who is a you know an Austin Westlake guy. Uh, this guy is probably from Central Texas and um, plays with a good quarterback and and also makes you know big time catches along the sideline. So you're talking about a guy like maybe an Amani Toomer that I used to love watch play. You know a guy that on third down is pivotal outside that can make your third and eight slants that can go out there and can have your your uh, your 10 yard comebacks and make a play on the football. He's going to be very useful for this offense. So again um, the player is really good at catching the football he catches it with his hands um, he's able to he has good route running skills how naturally fast can he get he could try to improve speed but you know they're going to be faster guys um, but the game's not all about speed it's also about leverage it's about catching the football how well will he separate how effective will he be at Clemson you can see him as a red zone threat early in his career and then maybe expanding to compete for a starting wide receiver role on the outside so noble johnson um what's at clemson 
really cleaning up in the state of Texas. They get an Austin, Texas uh, offensive tackle as well. So some pretty good recruits for the Clemson Tigers.